Okay, good morning everybody. Today what I'm going to do is I've got four small gold nuggets set up on a box here. I'll show you in a minute. And I've got the Manicore with a new 8 inch coil. What I'm going to do today is go through the uh, going over these small gold nuggets with both the old software version and the new software version. And we're going to see if there's any difference in the sensitivity to small gold nuggets. So Mine Lab has said that they've made it more sensitive to small gold. We're going to take a look at that and see if that's the case. So let me show you the nuggets real quick. Uh, what we got here, they're all pretty small. Um, probably a 20th of a gram, all the way down to less than a 10th of a gram. And I've got them so that it goes biggest to smallest around the four corners. And I'm going to get out the Manicore now going to set up this camera so that we can look at the height above the box hopefully okay this is the manicore uh, with the 8 inch coil before the update sensitivity 22 uh, running gold field recovery 4 we'll set it up the same way with uh, with the new version so let's go over nugget number 1 There's no no ID, but that's I think as close as I can get to, or as far away as I can get on that nugget. Here's nugget two. Again, no ID, but still an audio response. It's probably about as far away as I can get. Nugget number three. No ID, but a good audio response. And then here's the teeniest nugget. There's right on it. One. Without being right on it. Okay, so got the mana core set up with the 8 inch 5x8 coil sensitivity at 22 we're running the goldfield program uh, we're just using stock everything except for I think uh, reactivity I believe it was 6 I'm going to run it at well recovery speed I'm going to run it 4 so let's go over nugget number 1 this is going to be the biggest let's say right there is Audible. Then we got Nugget 2. These are pretty close to the same size. One of them just odd shaped, the other isn't. So I'd say that's as far away as we can get. Nugget number 3. Probably as close as we can get. Not even registering an ID, as you can see. And the smallest, which is under a tenth of a gram, that's right on it. And that was probably as far away as I could get and have it sound good. So that's the Manticore with the update. Okay, so let's talk about this for a little bit. Uh, I clearly think that there's a difference as far as sensitivity to really small gold goes. As, as you're going to see in the video, when you watch it from an angle where you can see how far above you had to be on each one of the targets especially on that littlest one you had to be right on it without the update with the new software i could get i'm guessing half to three quarters of an inch away so there's definitely an improvement in sensitivity to small gold as far as the the mana core goes with with the small coil i don't know about the large coil and i know that's what most people have right now um 
but there's definitely an improvement on that. I think it's great. They've made some, you know, changes to the audio themes, which was shown in another video that are available in prospecting mode. There might be a bug, which I've contacted MindLab about, about not being able to turn the Ferris tones on or off under the prospecting audio theme. We'll wait to hear back on that, but vast improvement, in my opinion, on small gold detectability with the Manicor. So we'll do a follow-up test and some mineralized ground here in a few days. We'll have another video out where we go over some different size nuggets and mineralized ground, see how the Manicor ha handles that. But overall, pretty impressed with both the coil and the update as far as gold hunting goes. All right, thanks for watching.